If you've been here in New York, it has been dominated by the UN General Assembly, the annual event where delegates come from all over the world to f up this city's traffic. <laughs> Almost every world leader has been here, but no one has had a bigger impact than Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi. Just this morning, he gave a sold-out speech at Madison Square Garden <laughs> that featured everything from dance numbers <laughs> to a live on-stage painter creating <laughs> a speed portrait of him. And I've got to say, Modi, classic out-of-towner move. <laughs> Comes to New York, stays a few days and leaves with a slapdash caricature done in the Times Square area. <laughs> You're a cliché, Modi. You're a cliché. But, but perhaps Modi's crowning glory during the trip was his appearance at last night's Global Citizen concert in Central Park. It wasn't that he gave a great speech. It's that he had one hell of a finish. Thank you once again for having me. Thanks in particular to Hugh Jackman. God bless you. May the force be with you. What? That, wow. That is a power move right there. Standing next to Wolverine and throwing out Star Wars quotes. <laughs> Bear in mind, this guy was banned from entering the United States up until just four months ago for his role in the Gujarat riots. That's quite a turnaround for him. And let me say this to all other world leaders. This is the new bar. Do not turn up to this city again unless you are with an A-list movie star <laughs> and throwing out quotes from films that they were definitely not in. <laughs> For instance, Robert Mugabe is not welcome here unless he's standing next to Billy Crystal shouting, To infinity and beyond! <laughs> For no reason whatsoever. And I do not want to see Angela Merkel set foot on American soil unless she is with Vin Diesel and screaming, I will have what she is having! <laughs> I will have what she is having. <laughs>